To start, you're gonna need some flour in a mixing container. This one's dirty because I just used it on a different tutorial, but that's okay. Unless you're doing this professionally, then don't do that. Um, you're gonna need some kind of spatula, um, a something round so you can flatten out and smooth out, some foundation that matches your skin tone, some liquid latex, and some toilet paper. Alright guys, so we are going to take some of the flour and add some foundation and latex and mix it on up to get like a paste. And then we're going to go in and place down our cut open smiles, if you will. And we're going to let that dry a little bit and then just keep adding layers of toilet paper and latex over it. Once you get the built up that you want, you're going to just texturize it however you want it to lay. And then after it dries, you powder it and take it off. And then placing spirit gum on my face and waiting for it to be tacky, we're going to place the prosthetics onto our face. And I just covered my eyebrows like usual and I'm starting to paint the prosthetic. The foundation that we used didn't really give the foundation color to the latex like that I wanted, but that's okay, we just covered it with our foundation. And now I'm going in and moving on to the eyes. All I did was kind of block them out with black paint and then I did really really defined like squiggles up from the top of the eyes. And then I set everything with powder and started to blend the bottoms down. And while that set I just made a couple more really 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 thin lines to give it more of a detailed look. And then we went in and did some bruising effects with brown, green, and purple. And then after that, you're going to color the middle of your mouth black, like it's a black hole. <laughs> and then we're going to paint the gums, and that is a pink. And then we're going to go in with red for the gums and the lips, just to give a little bit more of dimension. Now while that is drying, you're going to go in and draw some veins underneath the bottom of your eyes. I used a liquid liner so that they weren't so black, but you can do them and make them as black as you want. And then I'm going in with my brush and creating the teeth and adding the blood. And that is it, you guys. You are the smiler for Halloween. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Please don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel, Beauty by Josie K. Have a good day, guys. Love you. Bye.